Good morning, you beautiful people. I hope you are having a awesome Wednesday. I know I am. Um, Miss Redding, how are you today? Hi, Mr. Penland. I am also having a wonderful Wednesday. Super excited to kick this day off. It is hump day. That's always an important day in the week. We have a special guest with us. We have Miss Anderson. What's up? Hey, guys. Welcome to our show. Thanks. We're super Glad excited to be here. To always have, you know, new faces. Our faces can sometimes get boring on here, right, Mr. Penland? Yes, I'm especially sure. with our quarantine haircuts. <laughs> <laughs> it looks good, Mr. Penland. Thank you. I thank like you. it. Looks good. I love that you shared that to the Lorewood um, families. I love it. <laughs> Thanks for having me on here. Um, can I give a quick shout out? Yes, please. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Miss Saren for making that awesome we miss you video it was really really cool if you didn't get to see it um you can check it out on the sunday message or i think mr penland are you going to put it on the youtube channel yep i'm going to add it to the youtube channel so cool. you'll be able to see that on there um i'm not really sure what area i'm going to put it under miss Reddy, what do you think maybe the morning announcements tab yeah that makes sense. awesome all right awesome all right. that's a great idea i think it's i think it's going to be super cool for kids to be able to go back on you know if they're ever feeling sad and feel like they need to see our smiling faces to to go watch that or or teachers if we're feeling sad and we need to see each other yeah. you could always go back in and and see everyone i really loved miss dunkelberger and her chickens that was yes. like my favorite part that was my favorite part she she was great that was awesome so that was really funny. Since we're on that topic, I'm going to give a shout out to Miss Mall, who heard so many sounds. Yeah, like, that was cool, too. <laughs> that was cool, too. Yeah. That was awesome. All right, Mr. Penland, let's see how you can do with the weather today. I know we really um, ripped you apart yesterday. So sorry. But... <laughs> so my prediction was half right yesterday. Uh, <laughs> it, was, uh, it was nice throughout the most part of the day, but it, looks, it got pretty, it got pretty uh, pretty bad later on but today it's going to be sunny in the 50s so okay. today is going to be a lot easier all right awesome i mean not nicer day i mean aren't aren't most weathermen only 50 percent right <laughs> like isn't that a good well living? you know me i'm using my science technology engineering <laughs> art and math skills so basically perfect <laughs> I'm so 75%, your art skills. Right. <laughs> 75 percent right all right, share your screen with me so I can share the question of the day, please. Okay, Miss Redding, I have a uh, an interesting question of the day today. So I like pretty, it. It's pretty out there, but here you go. Okay. Here we go. So, boys and girls, would you rather have a pet dinosaur or a robot, and why? I can't wait to see these these responses. Please go on Flipgrid and tell us which you would prefer and why. Awesome. Hmm. All right, Ms. Anderson. That's a good go question. Miss Anderson, um, you should go onto the Flipgrid channel and put your, uh, what would you rather uh, have? Okay, I might yep. do that. Okay. Challenge. Uh, also, check out the Laura Grove YouTube channel to see the new read aloud from Miss Tom Chet. That's Perfect. gonna be on there too. All right, guys. Yeah, we should all do a flip grid. Everybody should do a flip grid because they're fun. Yes. That's awesome. Right, here we go. You guys ready? Yeah. All right. Lions inspire others to roar because we are ready to learn, have opportunities to grow, accept everyone, and respect ourselves and others. Because here at Lorewood, we are roaring with, with pride, pride and potential. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. Bye.